So hi everyone, welcome back to Electronics Geek. I am Ajay. So today we are getting the great opportunity from Cisco. So Cisco is hiring for the post of graduate apprentice training. And in the graduate apprentice training, there are multiple posts. So we will be seeing each and everything in detail in this video. So if you are new to our channel, please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. So let's begin with today's job date. So Cisco is hiring for the post of graduate apprentice training. And the salary here you can expect in between 10,000 to 30,000 per month. And the job location is going to be Bangalore. So let's see the position they are hiring for. So basically in a graduate apprentice training. So there will be a multiple positions like business analyst training, consulting engineer trainee, technical consulting engineer trainee, associate sales trainee, marketing trainee, site reliability engineer trainee, software engineer trainee, software test engineer trainee, and hardware test engineer trainee. Okay, so who can apply for this application? So if you have a bachelor's degree or the diploma, then you guys can easily apply for this application. And only 2023 and 2024 batch are eligible for this application. Okay, so if you are from EC or electrical engineering, then you guys can apply for hardware test engineering training. So here you will be working on the design as well as verification. So here you will be learning many things. So within a spam of 12 months. So this is basically an apprentice training. So the duration will be your 12 month and it will start from the August 2024. Okay, only the requirement is you should have a good communication skills. That's it. Okay, so how you can apply for this? So first you need to register yourself in the NATS website. So this is a government website where you need to register. Uh, this is for the apprentice program and nowadays most of the companies are, are recruiting through the apprentice program so this is the duration for the 12 month or six month depends upon the company so these apprentices will help you to understand how the industry work so this is for the final year and pre-final year candidates okay so what you have to do for that just click on this nats website okay so first you need to enroll here just click on student and in the student just click on student login uh so to register yourself you need following documents first Aadhaar card, your valid email ID, your phone number, your passport size photo and uh, your bank account details and your qualification degree or the provisional certificate, your first page of your bank passbook and the bank account statement if required. It should be in the format of PDF. Okay, so if you have the following seven documents, then you guys can easily register yourself here. So if you have the web data, just click on yes. So here first you need to fill out your email ID, your mobile number and click on send OTP. Okay, so once you're done with that, the next option will be you need to provide your uh, personal information like your name, your uh, college name, your education. At last, you need to upload your documents like your provisional certification on all. And once you submit this registration process, then ATS team will verify your documents, whether it's genuine or not. And once they verify, you will receive your NATS number. So after this, you can directly log in and you can apply for any uh, apprentice training, whichever you are. Okay, so once you receive the NATS registration number, just click on click here to apply. Okay, so the link is in the description as well as in the comment section. From there, you will get our website link of electronicskeep.com. So here you will get all the details. And here, just click on click here to apply. So you will be directed to the official page of Cisco. Now here, click on apply. Okay, so first uh, you need to register yourself. Just fill out your email ID here and click on register now. Okay, so it's very easy to fill out this application form. First, you need to sign in. And once you're done with that, then you need to uh, upload your resume. And after that, just click on submit application. So your application will successfully get submitted. And it's mandatory to have the NATS enrollment number. So you should register first in the NATS website. Then after this, you need to apply for the Cisco. Okay, so once you're done with that, you will you can check your profile by clicking on your my profile section and here you will get uh, the job title you have applied for. Okay, and if you find any difficulties while filling out this application form or if you had any other question, do let me know in the comment section and I will see you in the next video. Till then, take care, stay safe and bye bye.